round two on the draw, and that is a keep. Playing against Wombat Boy. Haller into Grand Warlord Radha. We've got just a uh, good hand here. Radha. What's cool is we can play the Grand Warlord attack with both of our guys and Ancient Animus. It's pretty sweet. That was a good draw. Mm-hmm. Nice. All right. Get in there. Let's add uh, red. I thought it doesn't empty. Oh, until end of turn. It doesn't empty. I see. Deep freeze. All right. Yeah, blood tallow candle. Sure. Chronicler, nice, especially with our Animus. So I can leave up Ancient Animus? I think I will. Especially given that I can play the Chronicler next turn. Kicked to get back my Animus is what I want to do anyway. Divination for days. Okay. I think we'll just kill that because I'm going to get it back. Um, wish I could get it out of candle range, but I cannot. At least they have to eat up their turn doing it. I guess that's good, but yeah, I guess also we're going to be just Keldon Overseer, steal your guy, get in for seven. So they have to eat up their turn. We get to steal their dude. Yeah, that's pretty sweet, actually. Can I sacrifice it? Can I? I suppose. I actually don't know if you can. <laughs> Let's find out. I doubt you can, but we'll see. That's so sweet.
All right. Is this still a legend? If it is, then... I can still swing into that. Chain Whirler, too. That's pretty slick. Um... Oh, I see. We go Chain Whirler, Animus, Fight Sphinx, okay, and kill our opponent. Okay, so blue-white with some skies. So our armament's definitely going to be good. Could do Broken Bond. Yeah, it's an out for Deep Freeze. Is there going to be more? Maybe. What do I swap for that, though? I don't know. Every single card in our spell, or card in our spell, card in our deck is pretty good. Uh, we could cut a creature. Do I need a broken bond for one deep freeze? Probably not. Hmm. All right, I'll just run it back. I think Arbor Arborman's much more valuable in this matchup. All right, it's a keep. Hand needs a little help, but it's a keep. Good draw. Possibly a necessary one. We'll find out. Arcanist beats. Jeez. No play, though. Well, I guess that's cool. Uh... You could play the Overseer and swing. Kind of like that, actually. Unfortunately, Lano Rebels becomes a big target when uh, they see you miss multiple land drops. No Arcanist beats this time. Well, that's okay. So, let's do the Grand Warlord. Get in there. Blessed Light It's my guess. Yeah. All right. So be it. guess we'll add a red mana that I'm not going to use. All right. Sphinx. Two cards on the bottom. Wild Onslaught. I'll probably do the Raider here, actually. My thinking is I could fight with Fire the Sphinx now, but I'd rather get another threat on the board, plus potentially draw a land. But I don't even know what to discard. Jeez. Halar? 
Why does his hand have to have all good spells? Well, our deck is full of good spells, so I guess that sort of makes sense. We have all kicker, too. Haller would just be so good. But, mm. Mm, mm, mm. That is tough. I don't know what to discard. I guess Halar. That's that's tough. That was tough. Mm-hmm. Mm. Five mana. I wish I had six. Wild Onslaught plus Animus to kill the Sphinx would be pretty slick. But I suppose we just take you out and go on our merry way here. All right, because that makes our Overseer a little bit worse, doesn't it? I would have attacked with the Snapper there, because I don't have a good block. But I'm glad they didn't, so uh, let's see here. Hmm. So two lands away from kicking this. Although kicking this at this point, I get rid of like a 2-3. That's not even that important. Guess we just get it out there. More wild onslaught fodder at some point. Tolarian Scholar. All right. Well, we're just waiting to get to that nine mana mark where everything becomes awesome. So let's just play this, scout, play the overseer and pass. We're basically just setting up for a big wild onslaught at some point. All right, I'd say we're in a pretty good board state. We've got just pure late game gasoline in hand. We're two mana away from kicked wild onslaught. Chain Whirler. Yeah, it's pretty sweet. I suppose we can attack now, too, can't we? Like, they probably make this trade. That would make sense. Which I'm okay with, too. Mm. 
Mm. I'm actually going to kill that. I don't want them to re-kick. I have to trade a fight spell for a thing, but that's all right. Like, I think because I still have the fight with fire, it's okay. If they rip some big fat flyer I got to deal with. Chronicler, which I can, yeah. I guess we could have wild onslaughted. Yeah, that's actually true. We'll get back the intervention, though. More versatile. But yeah, we could have wild onslaughted in the next... That's That actually may have been better in hindsight. I probably should have done that. So we're up to five, six, seven. So close. I can attack with the Allosaurus, though. They don't have, they really don't have a great block for it. And if we get the snapper off the board, we're in good shape. I probably should have done that last turn, I suppose. Taking it? What? Well, that's surprising. Yeah, if I had wild onslaughted, I would have even been able to double ramp with the Mar. Wow. I should have done that instead. I mean, getting fiery intervention is still good. It's not like I didn't get good value. It's just I think the value would have been extreme. Um, guess that's okay. The thing is, just Wild Onslaught is so good. So good. Chronicler. Well, I guess we can do it now. <laughs> yeah. Let's see. I Onslaught now. I want to see if I do it now. Buff Morrowin. Ramp 2. Still not enough, so let's hang out here. Oh, maybe he wanted to now do Fight with Fire. That's okay. I think getting the Wild Onslaught back is going to be pretty extreme. I'm not sure exactly what they're going to be able to do against that anyway. And just cast Fight with Fire next turn too. Kill everything. I guess we can't even kill everything, can we? We can only kill two things. I guess we could kill three things. I almost want to make sure the Wild Onslaught resolves first. Or we could just steal my Allosaurus back and attack. But 
Um, I'll, I'll, they already know about the onslaught, so I want to see if it resolves. Because if it resolves, I don't know exactly what they can do. But if they have a counter, I want to be able to do something here. Okay, so now we smash with, I guess not that, our six fours. They have five blockers to my one, two, three, four, five, six attackers. So now let's just get in with the six fours. Approach. Sure. I definitely haven't optimized this game, but the funny thing is our late game plan is just so excellent that it doesn't even matter. My opponent said I, I had a nice draft, so I said good game, thanks. All right, cool. We'll see you in round three.